Hi, let's see the application home automation using GSM. Here I am just using controller unit and GSM module and two relay sections to connect two different loads. So I just connected microcontroller with LCD unit so which which displays the status of system so which load is on which load is off and how the module which is functioning and GSM module here I am using through serial communication so the RXT and TXT pins which I am connecting with controller RXT TXT pins it is a TTL logic and the power I am taking from controller board these two are two power supply lines and this is your RX, TX and common ground and I just connected relay coil it, relay, relay module comes with three pins VCC, ground and input line the input I am giving from P3.6 and P3.7 pins so which are for two relay coils two inputs from two IOS and there are two communication lines RXT and TXT and LCD is connected with port 2 RS enable and four data lines D4, D5, D6, D7 here I am using LCD in 4 bit mode so these are my hardware connections related to this application so and now I am giving supply to this system through this 12 volts 1 amp adapter the power which is distributed to all and the status of application you can display it on LCD screen home automation using GSM now this application waits for message from user and you need to give proper message with a standard format from your Android mobile. So in my logic I given a standard format to turn on the load or to turn off the load. So I have two individual messages to turn on fan and to turn on bulb. The message you need to you need to give as this following format, which has star and they give the text within uppercase letters light on light followed by space and on followed by special symbol hash this is the format you need to give this is the message you need to give to turn on light now I am sending so you can find the response from load which is light comes to on now the fan is in stable state now I am giving message as star fan on with uppercase letters fan space on followed by hash now now you can watch the status of fan and now I am giving another message which is light on and which is light is received and again I am giving the message light off so fan on to turn off the light again I am changing my message light off the same format you can see the status of light so light off and this 
to turn off the fan again I am giving the message fan off the same format any text you need to give with star and followed by your text and end with hash so now your fan is going to off so you can watch the status of fan which is turned off you are looking to turn on all loads on you can give message as all on followed by same format star with the message all on so two load comes to on so this this is the way my application works I will explain you source code so just come to the system this is the source code I used to develop this application I used different header files for three individual modules one for LCD and second one for UART which is serial communication and GSM support and the two relay connections I am mentioning here which is connected with 3.6 and 3.7 and if you want to open these header files which is GSM support here I am sending all the commands related to GSM module which are attention commands AT and AT plus CMGF which initializes your module and AT plus CNMI it is a network identification module command and even the other commands I am using in my program which is AT plus CMGS which is used to send the message so and the other messages I am using like read the messages within main program so coming to this main and this displaying the text message in the initial case with LCD home automation using GSM and because of this your screen which displays as waiting for message once message rx function if you got any new message through gsm module your receive function works whenever you are sending new message to module which displays message receive and i am using string comparison function to compare my message whatever user is sending like on if it is compared which is giving 0 so once this condition is true it operates your relay 1 and it displays message light on suppose if you are sending the another message which is light off which operates according to your text message like I defined 6 conditions to operate 2 loads on off on off and I kept one more message for all on all off so these are the six conditions I am using from main program with all string comparison this is my simple logic even if you want if you anyone is looking for this application you can contact us thanks for watching